with Thanksgiving now in the rear view. Much of the attention now turns to Christmas, and for many, that means putting up a tree. So KSHB 41 News reporter Fernanda Silva headed out to a local tree farm on its opening day as hundreds of people lined up to take part in this holiday tradition. Welcome back. A Christmas tradition that awakes the senses. It's sharp. You want to smell it? Did you smell it? Smell great. Smell great. Just makes smell the, the house. Smell like Christmas. For almost 10 years, Tez and Tyler Poshek have been coming to Midland Holiday Pines to buy their Christmas trees. It's the best. We um, really enjoy Christmas. A tradition that became even more special in the last two years when their daughter Olivia was born. Hey, this is our Christmas yeah. tree? Oh gosh, it smells so good. Yeah. <laughs> There's the snow of Christmas. It is. It's, it's going to be our Christmas tree. An old tradition for some families, a brand new experience for others. We thought that it was perfect because it was nice and straight. It was the perfect height. And I thought because it's pretty good for lights on these branches. Rosalie's vision of a beautiful tree was similar to the one the Wegmans had when they started their business 22 years ago. They'll go out and find that magic tree. A work of love and patience. A full-size tree has been here for at least seven years, but this little one was planted in March, which means that it's going to be available for sale only in 2031. Some of these trees kind of like become like friends because you're all see them and you work with them every day. Friends that Judy now sees finding new homes. It's great to be able to sell a product that influences a whole family. It brings them together, it becomes part of their culture, part of their parties or whatever they might have. Memories that might not be framed. I say cheese. No, no picture. But that won't be forgotten. Those baby trees. Yeah. In Shawnee, Fernanda Silva, KSHB 41 News.